NVDA founder and CEO Jensen Huang delivered a keynote on Sunday that explored the transformative impact of AI across various sectors. The highly anticipated event at National Taiwan University was Jensen's first public address since arriving last week. The computer industry is now some 60 years old. In a lot of ways, everything that we do today was invented the year after my birth in 1964. If the data that, is, that we need to process continues to scale exponentially, but performance does not, we will experience computation inflation. I predict that every application that is processing intensive will be accelerated, and surely every data center will be accelerated in the near future. It is very clear that Many, many companies spend hundreds of millions of dollars processing data in the cloud. If it was accelerated, it is not unexpected that you could save hundreds of millions of dollars. Now, why is that? Well, the reason for that is very clear. We've been experiencing inflation for so long in general purpose computing. There's an enormous amount of captured loss that we can now regain. A great deal of captured, retained waste that we can now relieve out of the system, and that will translate into savings. Savings in money, savings in energy. And that's the reason why you've heard me say, the more you buy, the more you save. Jensen explained that these innovations would not only create new business models, but also greatly improve the efficiency of current ones in many industries. He also highlighted that such technologies would enable both enterprises and individuals to reach unprecedented levels of AI performance. Data processing consumes the vast majority of cloud spend today. This chicken or the egg problem has rarely been broken and it's taken us now 20 years, one domain library after another, one acceleration library another, and now we have five million developers around the world. Every single time we speed up the application, the cost of computing goes down. Over the years, we have driven down the marginal cost of computing in the last 10 years in one particular algorithm by a million times. Well, as a result, it is now very logical and very common sense to train large language models with all of the data on the internet. The emergence of artificial intelligence was made possible because of this complete belief that if we made computing cheaper and cheaper and cheaper, somebody's going to find a great use. His speech on opening a new era of industrial revolution prepared the audience for upcoming discussions on the future of technology. He further hints at new systems, software, and services set to be revealed at Computex later this week. This is Dimitri Brias in Taipei for TVBS World Taiwan.